All right, so welcome to my work from home study slash office area. For the past six months, I've been like adding things, changing things, and just making sure that this space here suits my lifestyle and what I wanna do. So I'm gonna show you guys what I have in my room today. Uh, I'm gonna show you the reasons why I've set my room out in this way. So if you guys enjoy it, make sure you set a thumbs up and subscribe down below. And let me show you some of the things that I have in my room. All right, so the first thing you'll probably notice when you walk into this room are all the fake plants that I have. I'd honestly love to have like real plants, but fake plants are a bit cheaper and they just don't die. Yeah, I hate to say it, but I'm a very forgetful person. So like, I will definitely just forget to water my plants. And I'm not even sure if there's enough sunlight for this room for the plants to just get enough of what they need. But the main reason for these plants, just to just liven up the place. And honestly, without it, it just looked very corporate, I think. Now, most of the things that I show you guys in this room will be linked down below. So if you guys want to check it out then you can do so i really wanted to create a space where like any angle i record from is gonna look decent now i'm not sure if you guys watched um, my 10 year youtube series i went through like an elon musk like entrepreneur phase but yeah i've got a lot of books here 10x rule law of success uh, david goggins book breathe all just a bunch of just entrepreneur books then i have this massive champagne bottle that eric got me for my birthday shout out eric fucking hate you man i'm kidding i love you i'm probably never gonna drink that because i'm not an alcoholic by any means i don't drink any alcohol and i have some lenses i have i don't know what the fuck that is a globe geography is actually probably one of my worst uh areas of study i don't know anything about where any place is and then i have some of my cologne here i've just got a bunch of random like ingredients which i never use but i wanted to fill these shelves up and i had literally nothing else so i put bicarb soda on my fucking shelf and then obviously if you guys have watched my last episode of my uh 10 year youtube series I created this like collage. Basically it shows just my whole 10 year journey on YouTube and, and just, you know, small things that have happened throughout the way, some bumps in the road. Then moving on, we have this like sit down, just chill area where I can just, you know, just sit down with a bit of tea or coffee, look out the window and just reminisce on all the dumb shit I've done in my life. My mom also racked these like black stools that fit perfectly under here and just the perfect height. Then we have like a charging station slash kitchen. It's not a kitchen. It's like a little area with a different appliances. There's a kettle, there's a, a, an, a grill. I think that's, a, it's like an, a mini oven. And uh, shout out to Cam P. This is like one of the coolest things that anyone has ever bought me. Okay, so look at this, look at this. So it's blue right now, watch this. <laughs> Literally just makes the room like 500 times better. And then last but not least, we have my desk set up. I have an iMac 2020 5K. I don't know what the specifications are, but the specifications will pop up right here. And then I have a monitor attached to it. And then one thing I really want is like one of those like really nice sounding keyboards, uh, like this, this sounding keyboard. Like it just sounds so nice. So like I want a keyboard like that, but I think they cost like 300 bucks and I'm just, struggling to justify whether I really need it or not, but it does sound so satisfying. So I probably will buy one, just not right now because I have spent way too much money on this setup already. But um, yeah, I've got the classic keyboard and the Apple mouse, and then I have poker chips here. Now I'm not a huge gambler, but like there is just something so satisfying about like shuffling poker chips. Oh God, don't you love that sound? And so whenever I'm like talking on the phone or like watching a YouTube video, watching Netflix, whatever it may be, like I just shuffle chips. Then I have a notepad here. Now I've been trying to plan out my videos. I did plan out like the first few videos that I recorded, but the past few vlogs, I have had no plan whatsoever. In fact, the plan for this video is literally, I've got two things on there. The introduction and then the fact that I'm a homebody, which is, you know, very detailed. But I think the problem with planning out the whole video, word for word, doing the script and everything like that is just, just doesn't feel authentic. So like, because I've noticed like in my other videos, like it, it just sounds scripted, it just seems scripted. It just doesn't seem like authentic and genuine. So we'll see what, what we do in the future. But yeah, I got a notepad there just in case. Then I've kind of just got a desk extension where I can just eat food or I can, you know, sometimes my girlfriend comes over and she just works from there. And uh, yeah, you, you can see there's just a bunch of random shit in this room apart from that like there's a neon sign like like an open neon sign which i felt like there needed to be some color in it apart from green white beige and black so i've added like a neon sign and then obviously cam got me this fucking sick thing and then my parents went to uh queensland and they got me like a candle holder i'm not sure how they came up with the buying decision of a candle holder but honestly it's pretty elegant and it it 
It's a nice touch. I actually really like it. And so I've got this desk and then I've got an extension and then I've got a, like an extra, extra extension, which is like just this small, like nice little, you know, this is like very mom's vibe. Like my mom loves shit like this, like antique kind of like old shit. I'll just like put like food or just like my tea here. And apart from that, I'm just looking around my room. Oh, this room is like very somewhat echoey and um, my parents can probably hear me right now. So I try and make it as quiet as possible and these soundboards do a good job of you know just like kind of reducing the sound from the speakers of the computer but I probably need to get more of those I just don't want to kind of like ruin the aesthetic and the the overall look of this room so I just kind of need to place them in you know spots that aren't gonna look too weird and that is it that is officially it I think that's everything that I've got in my room as I said before I'll leave everything that I have and I've shown you guys in the link in the description down below but yeah let me know what you guys think of my room let me know what you know you guys like and what you guys don't like how I can kind of improve this room and uh, yeah I'll, I'll change it up I'll continue to kind of try and improve it without spending a shit ton of money but yeah I've just been going like on a massive binge just watching like a bunch of like work from home study slash office videos so I thought I'd show you guys my setup uh, now that I'm finally kind of pretty content with it. Now, just to update you guys with the channel, I will be trying to up. I, I'm definitely going to upload every single Monday. It may, it may be Sunday, it may be Monday, but it's going to be one of those two days. No matter what, even if I'm going on holiday, even if, you know, shit hits a fan with my life, I'm going to post a video regardless. But hopefully, you guys enjoyed it nonetheless, and I'll see you guys next Monday.